It's been a month since former President Jacob Zuma was released from jail on medical parole. And next week, his foundation will hold a prayer meeting to welcome him. Zuma spent two months in prison. Um, and, of course, it was for being in contempt of court after refusing to appear before the state capture inquiry. Foundation spokesperson Zonele Manye says the prayer meeting will include a political session. And this prayer will be about thanking God for the steady work that he has done thus far in protecting his excellent president Zuma. This prayer will also be about asking God to continue protecting President Zuma and keeping him safe from the dark forces that want to finish him off. The Foundation is convinced that President Zuma has unfinished business in helping to truly liberate the people of South Africa. The country is a wreck. The country is deeply divided. The foundation is looking up to its patron, His Excellency President Zuma, to fulfill the historical mission of the organization that lives in his blood, the African National Congress, whose founding mission was to unite the African people. Bantu Bagiti, Hlanganani, Isita Sisindli. At the welcome prayer, we hope that more light will be shared in this regard. His Excellency President Zuma, is also a politician, so the program uh, will include a political session. Uh, details are still being finalized. The program is still being worked on, and the lineup of speakers is still work in progress. The occasion will take place in KZN at Tequini, at the place called the People's Park. At the same time, the Jacob Zuma Foundation also says the former president might campaign uh, for the upcoming municipal elections unless it's unlawful to do so. His Excellency President Zuma has got uh, black, green and gold blood. Uh, there should never be any confusion in anybody's head uh, that all the things that have happened to him will deter him from uh, supporting the African National Congress. There must never be that confusion in anybody's head. Uh, President Zuma, he sleeps the ANC, he eats the ANC, he wakes up the ANC, he's ANC in and out. And I th in fact, I think, I think the ancestors of the ANC are looking up to him to defend the ANC. His ANC right now is in ICU. The ANC right now is in a crisis. So the, 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 the forefathers of the African National Congress I try looking up to President Zuma to say we are the only trusted freedom fighter that uh, can bring this movement to the former glory that it used to be, because right now it is in tatters. Just Any to other on questions? that, yeah. um, he's also a member of the ANC. He doesn't have to be invited to campaign. He can do it as he wishes. So he will come. Well, depending on his uh, <laughs> medical parole and stuff, but I mean, talking about the video message, that doesn't uh, call for him to, like, you know, be invited to do that. He's, he's a black, green, and gold, and that's what it is. If it's not unlawful for President Zuma to campaign, President Zuma will campaign. The only thing that will stop him is if it is unlawful.